exciting as well. I know, I can't believe it. It's and gone so quick. And you were here from the very beginning. Absolutely, day one. It's I know. Amazing. It's been brilliant, it absolutely is. brilliant. What a ride. It's been it, it super. It is absolutely a wild ride. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> now, and what a way to kick out some of the celebrations with an amazing collaboration, Indigo I Blue. Know. With Zuri. It's incredible. We are so chuffed. We really are. And they are just absolutely delicious. You are, are not going to believe these. And it is a world exclusive as it well is. here at the craft store. Completely. Well, yeah, they're not in America. They're not anywhere else. They're just here. It is incredible. Well, let's have a look about that amazing one day special from Indigo Blue, that first collaboration with Zuri. I mean, it is incredible. Now, of course, these we are talking about amazing rubber stamps, clean foam mount. We know the quality from Indigo Blue. We know the designs from Zuri. We know what a partnership to celebrate the launch of the sixth birthday of the craft store. Well, let's have a look at the stamps themselves, the owl tails. I mean, look at the detail that you have. The, I mean, it's a dream collaboration. The designs from Zuri, the amazing etched detail of the rubber. Uh, can you tell us a little bit, uh, Kay, how did you that collaboration came out? I know, it's brilliant, isn't it? And we were so, so excited. I've always loved Zuri Moles, and the, the detail that they actually achieve is fantastic. And basically, it was just a case of um, being recommended, actually. And they were looking to make stamps, and we were recommended to them. And then we started talking, and we're completely on the same plane. If you know what I mean, you know when you meet those other artist crafters, and you just know exactly what they're talking about. And we were just so excited to be working with them. And we know that their detail that they get in their moulds is superb. And we knew that we could be able to transfer that into our red rubber stamps. And they're delighted with them. And so are we. So not only have we used their artwork as well, we've added more to the stamp plate. So you get lots of value for money. But these are really beautiful detailed stamps uh, nice and big as well so these are going to be great for all of your card making your journaling but also for your fabric art as well you can stamp these onto fabric and they are just super we're so excited about I this it's just amazing and they are just absolutely over the moon with it so it's been wonderful working with the it designers uh, well we can see that the one day special is those three amazing designs from Zuri the amazing quality from Indigo Blue now of course if you want to go for the one day special 919-322 is the other item number you have a 12 pound saving there and of course 59 pounds and 97 pence is your price for the one day special which are all three stamps you have got also flexible however hold your horses because of course we have got a complete collection that features not only those three amazing brand new stamps uh, from indigo blue and zuri but k okay, sprays I look know, at these beautiful sprays so we launched the uh, ink sprays um exclusively a few weeks ago um uh, last month i think and everyone adored them and we um we'd already organized um more colors to um, bring out so these are the matte ones they have got no sparkle in them and unfortunately you can't see the color because they are so intense they are so rich in color you won't believe what they will produce for you so they really are packing a punch these so they are concentrated beautiful inks and they are in the same packaging as well so you know that these are going to work beautifully there's no tubings there to get blocked it works on a vacuum and it just has a lovely fine spray and of course with them being an ink you can actually paint with them you can spray them you can use them on different surfaces but wait until you see the colors they are just amazing so of course with them being so strong you can dilute them down and i'm going to show you how to do that Perfect. which is just gorgeous so in the complete collection you are getting the stamps the sprays and also the brand new five colors of luscious pigments it's like a triple whammy isn't it, it that is. we've got these really gorgeous luscious colors as well well we had to bring something really extra special to you um, for the birthday and here they are we've got some really stunning stunning colors so these are our fairy tale set so you have here 
um, the beautiful, which one have you got hold of? Um, uh, got, got a, I've got Puss in Boots. You've got Puss in Boots there, which is a lovely warm brown. And you can see that we've had that added colour in, wow. that added duo tone and that added extra magical um, expression of gorgeous sparkles in there as well. So we've got Puss in Boots. The next one along, we have Gretel Pink, because we've got Hansel and Gretel, you see. So we've got Gretel Pink, which is an amazing, beautiful fuchsia colour. Really pops a, a really pop of colour, absolutely gorgeous. Next along, we've got Rapunzel Gold, which is a brand new gold. You'll have never seen this before in our sets. It's absolutely beautiful uh, next we have our Hansel blue which is another you know me I love colors this is a turquoise blue and then finally we've got our Pied Piper green it's a delicious set this I'm so pleased with them and I'm sure you'll absolutely love them um, we are limited on what we have in stock for in, the sprays in the, uh, and everything well talking about the uh, viewing limited well this is a collection that once it's gone is gone so I have to tell you that already a third of the stock has gone wow. now it is an incredible collection everything that is there is brand new it yes, is brand new. Absolutely. And the savings are carried forward and additionally you have got a £30 saving. Now if you add the total saving in fact is £53.30. That's wow. how much you are saving. That's amazing. It is amazing. amazing. That's incredible. That's like, it is. like it, a third off. Is that... I don't know my maths, but it's no, I'm not going to do off, maths it? because it's just, it's oh, just, in, uh, but what I will say is more than a third off, I think. Mm -hmm. like, that's a lot. Anyway, anyway but it is a fabulous saving. But not only that, of course, you have got a flexi buy option. And that flexi buy option is above £40. And you know what? Well, you know that in this part of the event, well, we have celebrating six years here at the craft store. So we automatically have credited you six pounds, which automatically uh, it will be deducted for any spent over 40 pounds. If you're an existing customer, it will be already on your account. I didn't know that. That's brilliant. Yeah. So you get another six pounds off. off. That's fantastic. Yeah, isn't oh, that's it? That's brilliant. It is indeed. Oh, so, of course, excellent. you have that. And on top of that, there is a free gift with purchase during every single live show of the Craft Store uh, 6th uh, birthday. And that means that, of course, for the Indigo Blue shows, well, you will get one of these ones. And, of course, it's one per, oh, per customer. So, you will get maybe like, the ex liveries. They are brand new as well, these ones, aren't they, Kay? They are, yes. They have been, they were out on the last show but they're so new absolutely I really love them really do so you might get the ex liveries of course free of charge you might get the cups I love these ones my I favorite do. but I also do. I love this one so I love them all yes. so uh, or the sunshine a flower now remember uh, do check out your baskets especially because of course if you want to go for the complete collection that features the sprays and actually the luscious powders now have sold out individually and remember all of them brand new colors uh, you need to check out your baskets now, um, is this is the spray colours? So I can't see from here, but um, yes, <laughs> yes they are. Um, so these are just the most beautiful samples. Look at the colours on there. The girls have done the most amazing job with these. Thank you so much, design team. Um, they are um, incredible. I'm just thrilled to bits. And you can see those luscious powders at work there. Oh. That gold and the beautiful green. It's just stunning, absolutely stunning. I need to show you this one. Look oh, at no. that. It's just wow. fabulous, isn't it? I look at the, I, you know, how long would she have spent doing that? That is just, it's just stunning. Beautiful. The names are on the back, I can't read it from here. Uh, this one Leslie? is from Leslie. Uh, but then oh, from that, gorgeous. I love, I'm going to put one of the uh, home decor pieces as well. This one is from Sue, Sue Jacob. Uh, I love that oh, because but I'm gorgeous. thinking of stamping onto fabric as well, which is something that you do yes. very much, isn't yes. it? Gorgeous, absolutely beautiful. And we have got more, of course, more samples, gorgeous. Uh, we look at that. I love this because you are getting the larger owl, but also the smaller one. You are, yes, because I thought um, for card makers, they may want to actually make smaller cards. So I actually put the owl on twice, a small one and uh, the really nice big one as well. 
Yeah, I love that. This is the smaller one. This is the larger oh. one also. Look at the detail as well. And if you are just tuning in and thinking, oh, I recognize that owl, but I have never seen a stamp. Well, that's because, of course, it's based on Azuri because it's a collaboration between yes. Azuri and Indigo Blue. Yes, absolutely. So it comes from the mold there. So that's, that's from the mold. Yeah. And that's the stamp. I know, it's great, isn't oh, it? Oh, it's beautiful. Oh, I just love the idea as well that you can put it on. I guess it's a slightly different size, but look how gorgeous that does. That, that's that's actually look, not design, actually, because we didn't have the dimensions of the actual mould themselves. No, but it looks but it, it's pretty much the same size, haven't you? It's it? a little bit bigger, but it, it's even better that way because it gives you that outline and yeah. it gives you even more detail. I love that. That's actually really nice, Paul. I'd never thought of doing that. That's lovely with well, the resin clear well, resin it's just it's just something that yeah. you can do now we have got big news actually <laughs> over half the stock of the complete collection has gone we are 11 what? minutes in this is a stock that should last the 24 hours and once it's gone, it's gone. So you we cannot get more of the complete collection. Already the brand new luscious powders in the fairy tales have sold out individually. The brand new matte sprays from Indigo Blue also have gone individually. Wow. The only way to get them is to go for the full collection and check out your baskets. Now, as I mentioned, you can flexivize if you want to, and of course you can. That six pounds uh, kind of that has been credited to your account at the craft store to celebrate the sixth birthday will be automatically taken off that to, uh, that first flexivy. Right, remember to check out your baskets. One seven zero two one seven is your item number. Be quick. Be sure to check out your baskets. It's absolutely stunning. The first collaboration, the first Suri uh, stamps with, of course, the quality of Indigo Blue. Right, of course, you will find them on the website, thecraftstore.com. Alongside also Vivid Ink Express as well that you can see in there that they have got a flexible option should you wish to go for those ones as well. The sparkly collection with, oh, look at them. They are beautiful, aren't they? And of course, you have got the essentials from Indigo Blue, including the grab and go, glue and then you have got us as well the slim gem acrylic blocks and so many more items that have got that five star reviews including of course the super thick slap it on is one of those iconic pr products that some people uh, call a glue gel and also uh, well actually a slap it on because that's, yes. that's how it has become <laughs> and, and of course the uh, gesso good gesso both in black and white uh, duo and of course also we will be talking about that virtual dirty we can because that is very exciting and there is so much more do check out the website thecraftstore.com and of course the flakes the flakes of course they are synonymous with indigo blue but anyway Kay we are eager to see the first demo so take it away yes so um, I'm going to start with the elephant uh, this is absolutely beautiful um, he's just the detail in this is just gorgeous in fact I had to ask him to take some of the details out so that we could actually really um, paint it and color it so i'm going to start off by just um stamping him i say him it yes. could be a girl Ooh. um in fact it i think it is girl is it and i think her name's layla yeah layla. yeah Ooh. i'm gonna i'm gonna call her layla because that's the name of um an elephant that we met in the um elephant sanctuary oh, when we were over wonderful. in uh, jaipur um and uh, they're all the retired elephants um, oh. in a sanctuary so um, and I took quite a fancy to Layla she's beautiful Layla. yes call her Layla right yeah. so what am I using I'm using a VersaFine ink pad because I want all that gorgeous detail to really show through now I'm actually using a new card to me and I have to say I'm really impressed with it because it really shows out all the fine oh. detail because it's very smooth um, watercolour card that um, Phil Martin um, oh, yeah. said try this and I love it so um, I've got a huge amount of it because it just it works goes, so yeah. well I'm it, using a stamping platform because I'm not great at stamping really big stamps <gasps> Look at that. Look, Look at, at that, that detail. The detail is just amazing, isn't it? That and is... just the finest, finest lines just show up beautifully. So with that being a, a slightly um, slow drying, 
I'm going to just waft a bit of heat over that. This is just a bit of scrap paper that I right. keep in there so that when I haven't put my stamp away, I don't make a mess That's of that. That's such a clever... I never thought I about know, doing because that. Because we, yes. we always end up with getting ink on the yeah. base, don't we? So I just put a scrap of paper there. So just and put I'm it sure to one side. After a few times, that will be an amazing background because then you have got yes. all those layers yeah, in there. Really lots of layers. So I'm just going to give that a little bit of a, a heat, yeah. OK? Just to make sure that, that ink is, is dry. Okay. Now, this ink needs to be waterproof so that when we actually paint it, we actually are going to get um, the, the a ink really, won't bleed. That's yeah. right. The ink uh, won't bleed sorry, out. Sorry, Kay. I yes. need to interrupt you one second, just because two thirds of the complete collection has gone. Oh I, I wouldn't usually interrupt, but it's, it's once it's gone, it's gone. So therefore, I don't want you to miss out in this fabulous. You are getting all of the three stamps as well as the sprays, as well as the luscious. All of them is That's not they are brand last, new. Is it? No, it's, it's not going to last. last. It's not. <laughs> and I'm so sorry we can't get any more at the moment. Um, that's just our whole whole stock of them, so I do apologise, um, right, but that's so all we can get. So I what I'm doing here is I'm taking these lovely vivid inks, yeah. okay? So um, Sheriff Nottingham, it obviously got to be black, hasn't it? Oh, okay, and what I'm doing is I'm actually, I don't have to shake these because they don't have mica in them, they are just a pure ink okay but when i've sprayed them i dunk them into water so that that spray head here there we yep. go that spray head doesn't get clogged up because it's ultra fine and if you actually leave ink around there it's going to get clogged up if it does don't worry you can actually just unscrew this top here and you can actually put it in hot water hot soapy water because the yep. plastic will expand and you can just actually just rinse that out and then just spray the soapy water through it, um, clean it out with warm water, let it dry and then put it back on. So, and as you saw, it hasn't actually got a tube in there to get blocked up. It works on a vacuum, which is why I love these so much. So we've got little John, he's a blue color. So see, you only need one tiny spray would you? I mean, uh, you know, uh, like my, my storage and my color index. I was thinking, I, I really, what I would do uh, on the top. I love that the top is flat because sometimes yes. the sprays aren't. So I might put a sticker with the color. That's exactly what I was going to do, actually. But <laughs> I ran out of time. But um, yes, I'm but definitely would, yeah. going to do that. Um, so we've got Maid Marion, and she's like a deep violet. Oh. I have to say, the color of my oh. water is gorgeous now, but you can't see it. Um, <laughs> So what I've done is I'm going to paint with them instead of spraying. I'm going to spray a background for you, but I just wanted to show you that you can put them in a palette. Now, th this is actually on the website, and it was on Ooh. Matthew Palmer's yes. show. OK, so um, and you can see where it dried as well, and you can actually just reconstitute it. Now, look at that blue. Look at that turquoise blue. Oh. Isn't that just amazing? That is beautiful. So... I didn't actually wipe it out, I just let it dry naturally and then I've just reconstituted it. So that's the beauty of this ink. Now we have other products in our range that are permanent, um, like our acrylic bases, but I wanted this to be reworkable, okay? So it so never becomes permanent, even when it dries? No, no, you can rework it unless you actually put something over the top of yeah. it. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to get a small brush. Now people are asking me, this brush is a zero, okay? So it's just a pointed round brush. And the brushes that you get from Matthew Palmer, those work beautifully. They're not going to harm your brushes at all. This is um, a, an inert ink, so it's really safe to use. So it's not going to hurt your brushes. And this is also a number one. Okay, it's just a different make. All right, so what I want to do is just show you um, some of the techniques that you can use. So I'm going to just swap over my water. So clean I've got water, some nice clean water. water. Yeah. I've got my rag in my hand ready. Okay, so I'm going to add some water to my. Let me turn that round and then you can probably see it better. And I'll just move over a little bit so you can see that. So I'm going to start off by just doing 
little bit of the elephant. Let's do this area here. Mm. So I'm just going to do the whole area and I'm going over the top of the black lines. And you can see that this is a translucent ink, okay? Yeah. And you can see that I've just added tons and tons of water to that and you get this beautiful turquoise colour. It has, hasn't lost the vibrancy. No, it absolutely not. It's softer, not. but no. it's not less vibrant. No, that's right. That. And if you want it stronger, you just add a little bit more ink. Like, yeah. if I just take a little bit of this and you can see that it's stronger, okay? But I just want it quite pale at the moment because the beauty of it being translucent is that you can overlay the colors, okay? By the way, Kate, we are 70% of the stock of the complete collection, 70%, and once it's gone, it's gone. We are not even halfway through the first hour. Make sure to check out your baskets if you want the complete Thank collection. Thank you so much, everybody. Thank you. Now, what I want to do is um, take this blue, I turned my palette around so I don't know where I am now. <laughs> Sorry, I have to just keep it the way I'm used to it. Right, so you can also mix the colours. So I'm going to take some of this violet. See how dark that violet is? Well, I'm just going to put a tiny bit in here. Yeah. Can you see that? Let me bring really it further yeah. in again. Sorry, I'm messing about. No, that's all right. Messing my director about. So can you see that lovely violet? We can, yeah. That is gorgeous, isn't it? Now, if I clean my brush, and I pick up some of my blue. Look, you can mix them up. Look at yeah. that blue there. That's look. So let me just put a little bit here so you can see it. Isn't that Ooh. stunning? Absolutely stunning. So if I take a little bit more of the violet and add that, we're going to get like a denim blue. Okay. Oh, nice. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? Yeah. Okay, so this is why I've given you all the primary colours. Yeah. So I've given you the yellow, the red, the blue. You've got a black so you can actually tone down the colours. Um, and of course you've got this violet. So now if I take this deeper blue and I come in and add that, yeah. then it's going to give you an added deeper tone and a different colour. Look at that. And it was just by basically putting a little bit of the purpley tone. That's Is it right. made? Um, oh, I can't. I uh, Mac made Marion, the purple one. The purple one is made Marion, yes. yes. So we've got uh, Will Scarlet, obviously red. We've oh. got Loxley Yellow. I've used the modern Loxley name mm. because then, you know, you yes. can see mm. where uh, Robin Hood was originally from, which is South Yorkshire. Um, you can um, see that we have uh, Loxley Yellow, Will Scarlet, we have Sheriff of Nottingham, who's black, of course, and Little John, who's blue, and Maid Marion, who is the violet. So you'll have noticed there's a few characters missing, but that's because we've got another set coming out later on in the year. Whoa, Okay, exciting. probably um, autumn time. So you can carry on doing that, and then, then I'm gonna change to a different color. What I'm doing is I'm gonna do the whole of the elephant in blues and greens and yellows. So I'm gonna come in for some of this yellow, okay? Now I have actually contaminated my yellow, but you can see that but that's that in the middle. There. I love the, the the fact that you can create your own shades and a kind of that mustardy green that you are creating as well. I know it's, it's gorgeous, gorgeous, isn't it? So I'm going to put just some pure yellow here. And okay. you you were talking about the concentration of ink and color that they were in these bottles. Yes, that's, that's something that you're very particular about, isn't it? Yeah, I am actually. Um, so you know, we've got great people that we work with. Um, but and I, I did try lots of different sprays from different manufacturers and they were beautiful they were really lovely but it wasn't what I was looking for first of all I wanted different packaging which took us such a long time to get this packaging um, and I also because I wanted it to not clog and to be a good spray so it was really important that I did that but also um, I wanted it incredibly rich and vibrant so that you could add water and water it down but if you've got something really really strong you can always take it back but you can't add more yeah. that's the trouble um, 
So, That's true, I, you know. Yeah, so now what I'm going to do, this yellow is so vibrant, it's beautiful, isn't it? It is. So now I'm going to come in with my watered down blue. And of course, what's going to happen, Paolo, when I put blue green, over the top of the yellow? Green, beautiful you've shade. You've got this beautiful, beautiful green. Look at that which is just stunning it's gorgeous and this is like i mean i'm I, i'm you know i love color i absolutely love color and one of the things i love about color is how the vibrancy the different things but the fact that you have diluted them you are creating different shades but they still have got the luminosity of the ease, yes the vibrancy yeah. they are not they are soft or they are not as dark, but they are as vibrant. Yes, absolutely. They don't lose any of the vibrancy, but that's down to, you know, the quality Good of the products we use. Because, yeah, you can get cheaper products, you know, or, um, you know, they're not quite the same quality. But if you go for quality, people will appreciate mm. it. I certainly do. It's and you don't always need to use so much. Mm. That's the thing. I always think it's a false economy, you see if you go for something really cheap because then you end up using tons of it. It's like when I paint my walls of my house, you know, I have gone down the road of getting the cheap yeah. emulsion and then I end up doing three coats and thinking, why didn't I just spend an extra Absolutely. few pence, you know? And the other thing is I was thinking about, so it is water-based, right? So you're it is. Really, so I would imagine that you can use it also to mix it up with other water-based products. Absolutely. But also you can use it in our Slap It On. Yeah. Also, you can use it with um, our texture paste exactly. and stuff like that wow. as well. So That's now it. I'm coming in with a bit of um, red, which is okay. the Will Scarlet. Wow. Gorgeous. And then you're going to get a rich, vibrant. So that is undiluted. Yep. If I just take my brush and just put a tiny, tiny bit on, then I'm going to get a soft apricot before it goes into orange. Perfect. So you can see that you're getting the most beautiful colours coming through. Perfect. Thank okay. you. I mean, of course, uh, you know, it's amazing to see the colors there on the sprays. And I need to say one thing, 80% of the stock of the complete wow. collection has already gone. I'm glad gone. I'm doing this demo first, yeah. actually. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> but do make sure to check out your baskets because those beautiful colors uh, are going to be, once they are gone, they are gone. So if you want to paint like Kay is doing right now, those beautiful azuri, designs made into stamps by indigo blue with the vibrancy of the sprays you can spray with you can cut watercolor with them and of course you have got the luscious luscious pigments in there the five parts of brand new uh, and of course you know what the fairy tales pigment uh, luscious pigments have already gone individually the beautiful uh, vivid spray inks they are gone individually the only way to get them is the, with a complete collection. And now, well, you know what? There was, you know, you need to check out your baskets if you want them because the complete collection, incredibly busy. Now, it the stamps, that is, I think, an incredible one day special that you can buy part of the complete collection or on their own. But is this is the complete collection that has got the biggest saving. You are getting brand new stamps from Indigo Blue with Zuri, a collaboration collection that has got the most detail in there with those incredible original uh, uh, sentiments as well. I love that. You are fantastic. I love that. Every possibility begins with the courage to imagine. You are getting all three that you can recognize the Zuri designs. They are molds from Zuri that they have been transformed into amazing detailed stamps that you can then fussy cut a stamp, a stamp onto fabric, color with your inks, your acrylic paints as well. You know what? It, oh, I, this is amazing. It would be amazing onto a silk and then kind of do like a sari for a sari effect. Yes. So there is just those kind of mm -hmm. oriental effects in there. And of course, if you want to be able to do that, and especially if you want to the sprays and the luscious, 
Please be quick. Uh, we, we, we don't want you to miss out. And this is a collection that once it's gone, it's gone. We are not even halfway through the first hour, or ha you know, half past the hour, and already incredibly busy. 80% of the stock has gone. You're getting five brand new colors from Luscious Pigments. You know it, that you can mix them with a, I mean, you can mix them with the Vivid uh, Express as well. Create your own shades if you wanted to. And of course, remember, celebrating the, f the sixth uh, uh, birthday. I was going to say anniversary, no, but the, well, actually, <laughs> it's the sixth anniversary well, it is. of, of, it, uh, of it Indigo is. Blue being here at, at the craft right. store. And of course, it's the birthday. And remember that you are going to get a, a, you know, a free gift with purchase in every single live show. So if you are going for the one day special or the complete collection, you will get in your, in your delivery, in your parcel, one of the following sunshine flower cups or ex libris. But not only that, you are getting a free gift with purchase, but you also are getting a discount, well, a, an amazing saving. It is a 30 pound saving. However, if you can see there the individual savings that are carried all over, you have got in total a saving of 53 pounds and 30 pence. It is an incredible saving. And also remember that it is, if this, well, you are, this is the launch show of the birthday event, your, uh, your account here at the craft store will be automatically credited with a six pound voucher over a spend of, uh, uh, of 40 pounds. Which means that even if you flexify that six pounds will come off. So imagine that saving, free gift with purchase. You have got that incredible saving, and then of course that six pounds about it. So do check out your baskets. One seven zero two one seven is your item number. Let's head back to the master at hand here. Yeah. Look how quick that was, eh? Hey, <laughs> that is just gorgeous. <laughs> But again, when they dry, watercolor, so I went to a, a, a watercolor kind of, you know, f um, aficionado as well, and she was telling me how most watercolors, they become a little bit dull, uh, water-based. Uh, yes. Yet the intensity That's of right. those sprays. That, this is why I wanted this particular type of ink, because when it's dry, the intensity is still, still there. there. You still have that vibrancy, and yet you can get those really dark, it, deep shades. Now, I wanted to show you a little yeah. trick. I don't know whether you can notice but down the center here it's almost highlighted okay yeah. just down the center of her face and her trunk wow okay so I want to show you if you get just a clean brush and I'm just going to put a highlight down the center of the trusk a uh, uh, tusk with just plain water okay. okay so again clean your brush and just plain water just down that center point here just be careful that you just go down the center area where you want that highlight, okay? So I'm gonna do that over a few times and then just let that sit for a minute or two, okay? So this will be quite subtle because I'd normally leave it for a couple of minutes. I'd make a cup of tea or something and come back. But just get yourself a, um, a kitchen roll. It has to be paper because if you're using one of your cotton rags, um, it will, um, it could smudge it. Okay, so you can see where you get that lovely highlight there. Wow. So you can see it takes off some That's of that gorgeous. colour and you get that highlight. Yeah. And that is the difference between getting something that really, really brings it to life. Yeah. Suddenly and it becomes again, 3D. Yeah, it because does. It does. And, and, and we could do it on the outside here of um, her ears, but uh, I think that deepness takes it back and yeah. the face comes forward and I like the fact that I've done that in blues and cool colours and the background in the warm colours and of course those are all made with just those five colours in your set so that's your beautiful elephant what I'm going to do now is show you the background okay so this is a really simple background first of all I'm just going to wet my watercolour card this is Phil Martin's watercolour card that you can find on the craft store website I'm going to turn that over so that it sticks to the glass board Ooh. okay and then I'm going to come in now the reason why I do that is that both sides will be wet when I finish so obviously both sides will have the the cotton um, the fibers I should say stretching so yeah. it won't curl Either up okay so all I'm gonna do is I'm actually just gonna paint with water clean water I know you can't see it at the moment just a rectangle on the inside I'm leaving a border okay now yeah. what I could do is I could spray into that yeah. but I want a little bit more control so I'm gonna come in with my big brush and I'm just going to <gasps> touch that yeah. 
and just see what what happens with it. I'm just going to help it along. Those colours are It's intense. just incredible, isn't it? Yeah. So I'm just going to put a little bit up here because I'm going to put some green up there. I'm going to leave this yellow with a, a little bit of orange. I'm going to clean my brush. Okay. And that's Loxley yellow. That's Loxley it? yellow. I'm going to come in with Will Scarlet. Look at that. Look at that colour. <sighs> Yeah. And I'm going to push that into the Loxley yellow. So where it crosses over, we're going to get a blush of orange coming through. Okay. Let's just bring that right out there. And I'm using strong colours. So, you know, if I wanted them a bit more softer, a bit more subtle, I'd actually water them down a bit more. Okay, so now I'm washing my brush in water again and I'm coming in with some of that beautiful, beautiful blue, which is Little John. Oh, look at that. It's such a that. luminous blue. It's like it a is. cobalt blue or something. Well, it is. It's, a, turqu it's turquoise, a lovely yeah. turquoise. And look at that green yeah, that I'm going to get from there. Oh, look at that. Okay, so I'm going to just leave that to just mix and merge now the one I did yesterday to prepare I added more water so it was more um, softer now where's my water spray oh, she oh. says do you know what, what? I that? haven't actually brought it Ooh. oh I'll, I'll, okay I'll, I have got one backstage so I'll give you okay one, yeah. okay so I'm just gonna dip my finger in some water and do a few little smudges there and just take my brush and just Look at that. help it along to mix and merge but I don't want um, that green going into the red really okay so I'm going to leave that to dry and I'll show you what it looked like mm -hmm. the one that I did okay. yesterday yeah. okay so this one had a lot more water sprayed on it so that I got some areas Ooh. of lightness but, but again, but it's the intensity of the colours. It's gorgeous, doesn't it? Yeah. Look at those blues and the and where yellow. The, the red meets the, red. The, 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 the green on the top. Absolutely. That line and you can see exactly where yeah. I've sprayed, can't you? I've just yeah. done a couple of sprays and just left it. And you can see the intensity of the colour is gorgeous. It's beautiful. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to have a bit of a stamp. And what I found was when I was playing around was that stamping and white embossing on this looks amazing. So I'm just going to get some white car, uh, some scrap paper underneath. I'm going to be using a Versamark, which is clear, but having said that, my stamps are dirty, so you'll be able to see these very, very clearly. Okay. And I'm going to just stamp a few of these diagonally going across from top to bottom okay yeah. so we've got now these are from the same kit okay so yeah. so yeah. you've got all of those stamps and I've done you those beautiful little elephants which are so at the bottom, cute as well as some you know funny sayings as well if you want to use them for birthday cards okay so let's get uh, let's get some more on here and you're using Versamark? I am using Versamark. If you don't have Versamark, just use um, a normal ink pad. Okay? So as long as it, um, you're quick yeah. or it's a slow drying one, fantastic. So even Versafine would work, right? Yes, absolutely. But because I'm doing um, white, I just wanted to make sure that, you know, I wasn't going to yeah. end up with black halos around them okay so okay. the uh, I'm using a really really ultra fine embossing powder so this is our indigo blue embossing powder and this one is called white cliffs of Dover right. so you can see how incredibly fine that is all right and give that a little bit of a a flick. Okay, so uh, there we have uh, the ultra fine embossing powder pods. You are getting four of them, uh, thirteen pounds and ninety nine pence. You are getting, of course, uh, the uh, is it the silver, the gold, the copper, and it is, yeah. it is, and yeah. the white, of course. Four to five zero four five is your item number for all four of them.
So don't worry, this that. doesn't take long. It'll only take a few seconds. That is gorgeous. And you are not afraid to use the heat gun over an ink spray. No, the not colour at won't all. change. No, it won't change at all. I mean, with all colours, once they dry, they um, they do change ever so slightly. But the this particular pigment that I've used, it's really good for that. It doesn't seem to Could be um, cooked. You know, dry at mean. all so let me just check with that <gasps> that i'm going oh, to i think i might no. have one over here actually in that blue i think that's going to yeah. look really lovely well, is it all right if while you do that i give a reminder yes, everybody please. because the complete collection we are approaching limited collection and um, limited stock so it's an amazing collection but also what i wanted to make sure is once they are gone they're gone so if you are thinking oh should i get it should i not be quick to make that decision we you know if if you are okay with losing you're missing out that's fine i know many of us we make our mind up and we're thinking we want the new brand new sprays we want those fairy tales beautiful luscious pigment powders and of course those stamps and you know of course this amazing amazing brand new collaboration with zuri now you are getting the owl tails of course those gorgeous owls and i love that you are getting both sizes a magnificent size there for your home decor elements as well as your art journals and your larger Cards, but then the smaller one as well. You are getting, of course, the beautiful elephant Layla there. I think is and and to know that, of course, he has been to an elephant sanctuary, so that kind of bond is even more special. And then, of course, you are getting the enchanted castle. Now, if you are thinking, oh, of course, they remind me of something, they will remind you, of course, of Zuri Mose because that is the collaboration. Look at this beautiful creation here. This one is by Leslie. Look at the castle. Look at the fine lines. It is incredible. But look at the, the you, you can overlay them together. Look how beautiful they look. Because, yes, they are a little bit larger, but that makes it like a shadow, offset shadow. So if you are a Zuri fan, you need to have this collection you need to be able to kind of think you have got the zuri stamps the first collaboration that they have made with indigo blue to create the most delicate beautiful kind of stamps i was looking at this sample early on and you can see the beautiful luscious golden sparkle in here but you can see as well the fineness of that detail you know when you look at an azuri mold and you're thinking it is an incredible detail that has been achieved in the stamps that has been achieved because they are red rubber look at that red rubber finely edged because we know indigo blue they like the quality and that's why it's such a beautiful partnership now of course if you want i'm going to grab shall i this stamp set here because look at the quality look at the thickness of the format look at they are completely and crisply fussy cut ready for you to do no kind of having to mount them no having to cut around ready to go and look at that look at this beautiful element so you can use the dragons on their own this could be the first page of a fairy tale i mean there is so many ways of coloring these beautiful stamps and look at that I mean, isn't that just gorgeous? I mean, the design team has had a blast making these samples and you can tell because the amazing samples that they have. Do you want to have those stamps? You want to create those beautiful backgrounds? You want to have the coloring possibilities from Luscious with the brand new fairy, fairy, uh, fairy tales? Well, you can still, but now we are officially limited to stock for the complete collection. Well, well, okay. <laughs> Once they are gone, they are gone. So if you want the complete collection, check out your baskets. Remember that the savings are carried forward. So in actual fact, you are saving 53 pounds and 30 pence. You, on top of that, you are getting a free gift with purchase. One of the new collection editions stamps already, of course, form mounted. And remember, for, to celebrate the craft store six birthday, six pounds has been credited to every single craft store customer uh, account, existing customer, of course, 
and you will be able to check out your baskets automatically even if you flexify because it's above 40 pounds and it will be deducted automatically. Imagine that paying well 44 pounds and 94 pence minus six pounds for this complete collection and then of course you will pay uh, 44 pounds and, and the pennies uh, next month. Grab yours, check out your baskets 170217. Remember limited stock and once it's gone it's gone. Okay, can you believe it? We are not even at uh, end of the first hour. Do you know, thank you so much and you won't be disappointed. I promise you these are just absolutely amazing stamps. They are gorgeous and you'll love the sprays and the luscious, of course. You know um, those, of course. Um, so thank you so much. Um, I'm just uh, blown away. Um, I'm going to be phoning Alfie again. Are you sure there is no more stock anywhere? Okay, so um, let's finish this off for you. So what I've done is um, I've done the embossing with the white uh, powder, which is the White Cliffs of Dover. And you can see it's a really, really fine one. And then what I've done is I've splashed it with water because, as I said earlier, you can actually take away some of that um, ink yeah. okay so that's been sat on there for a few moments well um so we need to wait a little bit yes right? yeah so whilst you were doing your job i actually just dabbed it and you can see that oh, now that. when you take it off you can get that lovely texture coming through with those splodges of water I'm, which is just really lovely I'm i actually so like this one this how it's just got the yeah. the edge which is gorgeous it's beautiful yeah. isn't it and when I, I, I'm keeping being impressed because no matter how much you dilute them how much you lighten it the nature of the color stay, stays and that is something yeah. quite special I think because sometimes certain colors when you dilute them and because they are not as good quality they lose their intensity hue. yes you know they they become yeah they become completely pastels that have no vibrancy they do but that's these right. ones are just still lighter but still as vibrant that's right yeah and that again that was so important and as i say i've got great people that i can ask advice for that um, know about pigments and different sorts and um so when I ask the questions of what I want, they can go, oh, right, well, you want this sort of pigment or you want that sort of, you know, um, product. And they, they help me enormously to do, to do that. So I'm very grateful to them for um, giving me the right advice for the right um, ingredients to go in these. So, um, yeah, they do a, a marvellous job for us. Yeah, so what I did was I put a bit of tape on and then I put my grab and go on. Um, so this one that I didn't dry flat has got a little bit of a bubble in it. So if I just hold that down. Would you leave it with a heavy book or something like that? Or um, would yes, you can do. But I find that the grab and go actually does grab quite quickly. It's just okay. I haven't got enough hands, really. <laughs> That's the only thing. Yeah. Um, and um, I've obviously, you know, spilt some bits of red on there. So what but I'm going to do is... Yeah. yeah. Do you but like it? I do like it, but if you tell us how I'm, to resolve that. I'm maybe. actually going to just put oh. some clean water on that. So, yeah, make sure it, it is clean. Okay. And I'm just going to leave that for a minute yeah. just to lift, lift it. Yeah, don't, yeah, I'll, come back to, I'll come back to this. So I'll show you one I did at home. Oh, so this is what I did at that. home. And again, it's completely different. This has got a lot more water on it. So I sprayed it with, um, I put the water on, yeah. I put the inks on, let them run a bit. And then I sprayed it with water and then I sort of, wiggled it around quite yeah. a bit and so it's a lot more diluted as you can see it's a lot yeah. more softer the yeah. colors but it's still I but it's I mean, still it's gorgeous still, like, isn't it from here the yellow is <laughs> is, is is beautiful it's sunshine yellow when with sometimes it, you know again if you dilute it it becomes something wishy-washy no this That's is right. just beautiful colors and they all blend so beautifully together they do, creating yes. those different shades in between again it, it, when you like color like we do you know that's those things are so important and look, look at that. that that's just gonna look amazing isn't it or if I turn it round so that we've got it like oh yes. that 
that's yeah. gorgeous, like a sunset behind. Okay, so I'm just going to use some grab and go. Which um, this this has been incredibly popular. It's a really brilliant glue. Um, it's in a nice soft bottle to squeeze, and also it's got. Let me hold it still, then you can see. So when it's closed, it has this um, this little nipple here. Mm -hmm that pushes any excess glue no out of the tube. So you never get it clogged. And then all you do is you just twist this bit of the top and you can see that that yeah. nipple disappears and then it opens up an area for the glue to come out. Okay, so then you can just put it on. And this is um, quick drying as well. So, and what I, I tend to do is I tend to sort of just spread a little bit on the the edges here oh one thing I was going to tell you actually yes. which I completely forgot um, I'll bring in this in a minute um, just before I know I'm finishing this off but there was something that I just wanted to tell you about fussy cutting okay um, oh that's lovely that's Isn't beautiful. That such a gorgeous I love stamp? that such a gorgeous stamp it is so I just wanted to tell you I've forgotten to um, share this but for example clean water okay so fussy cutting I tend to cheat a little bit myself I like I like cutting out at the moment you know I just take it in from my my studio okay. sit in front of the teller with Alfie and I'll, I'll be cutting out <laughs> <clears throat> so what you want to do well what I do is it, you know, everyone has a different way of doing it is if you're going to be fussy cutting make sure that you just cover the whole of that area, including all of those little bits, oh, yeah. because then when you fussy cut round, because I leave quite big gaps, yeah. I don't go into every tiny little area, as you can see in here, I've left quite a lot that I don't actually cut into. But because I've painted the whole area, I can get away with it and there's no white. And also if I cut away from the line, which I do invariably a lot. I don't cut right up to the line. I leave a little bit of a gap. Then you're not going to get a white space around everything. So you can see that's exactly what I've done here. And then I've gone back in with my red or my orange, my Will Scarlet or my orange. I've actually waited until that's dried and then yeah. it won't move, but hopefully that's not too bad. And then I will actually go back in and start colouring that in oh. and also um, I've got if you don't like colouring in don't worry I've got um, some demos where um, it's a no colouring in demo but, <laughs> well, well if you go for the complete collection you have got the sprays as well so you could just right. create a sprays absolutely absolutely but you need so to you be can quick. see there that um, as I say I went with all blue on there and yellows and reds in the background but I'm really really pleased yeah. with that but you'll, um, but you'll love them. If you've got the big bundle, you'll love it. And thank you so much for that. That's gorgeous. By the way, uh, if you want though, if you want to do what Kate is, has been doing, you need to check out your baskets. Uh, very, very limited stock now. It will go before the end of the hour. You know, you, you can bet on it now because it is incredibly busy. Make sure to check out your baskets. Remember that you put it in your baskets and every 10 minutes it auto refreshes. So if you don't want to miss out, now is the time. Once it's gone, it's gone. You are getting all three beautiful stamp sets from Indigo Blue and Zuri, the designs by Zuri, and of course you can see it's a world exclusive. Here launching at the craft store for the first time, nowhere else in the world. And you have got the red rubber synonymous with, um, of course, indigo blue, that etch designs there. But then, of course, Zuri designs, the enchanting castle that you have in there. You have, of course, the uh, ornate elephant and, of course, the owl tails. They match the, uh, the molds. They match the beautiful intricacy detail. And the best thing is that because it's a slightly different size, you can still use the gorgeous uh, molds into especially the owl and the enchanted castle and you enhance your resin molds done with Azuri. But 
expert, of course. That's one component of the one day, uh, the, the complete collection. That's the one day special, in fact. You have got also five brand new colors, beautiful, vivid ink sprays. You are getting those colors that are sold out individually. The only way to get them now is with the complete collection. And remember, extremely limited stock. Alongside of, of the vivid inks, you are getting those brand new luscious powders. There you are getting the, the fairy tales of, of course, of the luscious pigments with Puss in Boots, uh, Gretel Pink, Rapunzel uh, Gold, Hansel uh, Blue, and Pied Piper Green. All five of them. And remember, you can mix them up with all sorts of the slap it on as well, create your texture paste as well, with your gel mediums as well, even with the, I believe, uh, and one of the techniques I love as well, it would be to put it with your clay for the malls, from the Absolutely. Zuri malls. Absolutely. And these actually work incredibly well with the clay because you get a really vibrant yeah. colour. So obviously you're mixing it with white, but it looks fantastic. Well, uh, sorry, Kay, but I need to interrupt you again. We have got a technical sellout. Uh, that means that it's gone. Wow. It's all the stock has been allocated to people's basket. If you have it in your basket and you want it, to check out. If you don't want it, let somebody else have it. Because it, seriously, but if you want it, and I think if you have put it in your basket, you really want it, do check out your basket. Now, remember that is for the complete collection with the inks and of course the spray inks and of course the luscious powder. Now, if you are just tuning in and you, you want the stamps, you can get the stamps because that is the one day special. What you cannot get is the sprays and of course the luscious powders. Make sure to check out your baskets, please. Gee, if you, we would, I would hate to, for you to miss out. So make sure that you do that. You, uh, with the one day special, you also have got a 12 pound saving and you are getting the most exquisite. I love the fact that you have worked with Zuri to bring in their first, uh, the first collaboration. Uh, it's incredible detail. It is, and, and that was what was so much fun actually to work with them and, and their designers. Um, it, it was just fantastic, and um, I'm really hoping that we can carry on yeah. the way we've gone with it. So um, I'm just really excited about it. And, I mean, look um, at that. It, they look great it. together, don't they? They do. Uh, but, but what I love as well is that suddenly these designs become something else as well. It's kind of the next step of that story that That's Zuri right. Moss tell. Is now, I mean, the way that they have trimmed that off is just being image. I love as well the elephant family at the bottom, the yes, solid. Yes, yes. It's so that was, that was my small contribution, actually. <laughs> well, that's the thing. When you have got collaborations like this one, Indigo Blue on Zuri, you will have incredible, incredible possibilities. Well, Do that's because I've got my stamping head exactly. on. Exactly. So obviously, you know, I, I will say that, you know, oh, this is great to stamp, but I want extra stuff like the extra Absolutely. dragons and things like that and have those separately so that you can stamp with those. Um, and, and yeah, absolutely. So it's um, it's going to be, um, I can see us working together again. And Perfect. I think that'll be fantastic. That would be fantastic. Thank you, Kay, so much for your wonderful demos, but oh, especially for bringing uh, this amazing collection, this amazing collaboration. We'll see you at eight you with will. this card. Yeah. Uh, and of course, uh, to you at home, do check out your baskets. Mm -hmm. the, uh, of course, the birthday of the craft store continues here.